Hi guys, Jimmy here. Welcome back to my channel. Hope everybody's doing well, staying safe, had a great week so far and looking forward to the weekend. So it's finally here, what seemed like an eternity of waiting for, one of my most anticipated releases of the year. And it is of this classic, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre from Second Sight Films. And they have done a doozy of an addition with this. So it was a little bit delayed because the post isn't great at the moment, uh, but it was worth waiting for. Let me tell you, it's worth waiting for. And Second Sight have also done something really nice. If you ordered it directly from them, they give you some extra art cards, which are really, really nice. So I'm going to be doing an unboxing of this. And then it took me back to when I managed to pick up this little fella from Arrow Videos. And I got this, believe it or not, in HMV. It was one of my first Arrow purchases. And I got it for £7. And it was from HMV in Birmingham. And they had a sale. And even the guy behind the counter said, I can't quite believe we priced this up at this price. And I was like... I'll have it. So I'm going to do an unboxing of that as well, just very briefly at the end of it. But we're going to concentrate on this doozy of a release from Second Sight Films, and it doesn't disappoint at all. So anyway, enough of me going on. Let me show you what you get with the Texas Chainsaw Massacre from Second Sight Films. Hi guys, so here's a closer look at what you get with the Texas Chainsaw Massacre from Second Sight Films. So I have unboxed it already, just to save a bit of time. But here's your paper J card that you get with it. And the reason why I left it unboxed straight away is that we're just going to get into it straight away without messing around. So there you go. Can you survive the Texas Chainsaw Massacre? It happened. And I love the silhouette of Leatherface there. And nice and simple on the back. And you've got these marks on there, which are almost like blood splatter on there, which I think is really, really good. Him wielding his chainsaw. Um, here we've got the actual discs that comes in it. And when you open it up, you get three discs. You get your Blu-ray, you get the bonus disc, and then you get the 4K. And behind each one, it's just red. There, there is no artwork on the inside, but the artwork on the discs are fantastic. Then if I flip it over, look at this, that it lines out from a scene from the film where she's trying to get away from them and they're chasing her down. Um, there is a slight bit of damage here, but that's been taken care of for me, so I've got no problems with that whatsoever. But that is just an amazing piece of artwork to put on the back. I think that is fantastic. Actually, on a shelf, um, that would look brilliant. Let me flip that back over. Okay. And then you get a booklet. No, I shouldn't even say a booklet. You get a book with this, not a booklet. You get a book. And look at this. Now this gives you details on the film, the artwork, the cast and crew. But again, when Second Sight do books, they do books properly on their editions. And then there we go. All the details that you get inside the book. And, you know, I wouldn't be able to show you every single page because it would go on too long. But it, it gives you all the little extras in there. Some nice information, the family, the main characters. You see the artwork in there. Um, and you'll just go through the whole lot. I haven't read it yet. That's going to be my reading for this afternoon. But it is some book. It really is some book. And they've done it extremely well. Now, I could be wrong on this, so do correct me if I am wrong. Now, if you ordered it, I think, from Zavi or HMV, let's say, you get six art cards with it. This is a stunning art card. It really is. Just the fear in her eyes. Good old grandpa. There you go. Poor girl. The suffering. My God. The anguish. Leatherface himself. And then there's Paul. Now, you've got six art cards with it. Now, I ordered mine directly from Second Sight. I always do that. And I do believe that if you ordered it directly from them, you get a bonus of three extra art cards. Now, I could be wrong on this, but I'm, I'm led to believe this is correct. Um, this scene here makes me squint still. Ouch, when she gets put on the meat hook for the first time. That is painful. Um, and then you've got where he's dragging her in to the um, room, first of all, from the porch. The artwork is just stunning. And that's where she's going up to the porch to knock on the door for help for the first time. But that's what you get with it. Um, as I say, got these three extra art cards. I'm, I'm pretty sure they come with it if you get it from Second Sight directly. And if you get it for everywhere else, you get six art cards with it. But if you purchased it from Xavier or HMV, please do let me know. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna show you briefly Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2 from Arrow, because I've got that as well. Um, so yeah, let's get on to part three of this vlog. Hi guys, so here's a really quick look at the Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2. The Buzz is back, which is a, considered a cult classic now, Part 2, in all fairness. So this was one I picked up from Arrow, very early one of my Arrow collecting days. So you get the actual film here. This is the artwork on the outside. 
It's the artwork on the inside. And here is the disc, in case if you're wondering, I'm going to do it in reverse. The disc is locked to region B on this one. Um, so you get the film there and then you get a booklet with this, which tells you about, you know, cast, crew, details of the film and everything like that. So it's a nice little booklet on this one here. There's some nice detail in that there. Um, and then they did a parody of The Breakfast Club um, and they've done this scene for it, which is a quite a popular poster. Uh, that's just a flyer that they put inside it uh, from Arrow. But yeah, so they did a parody of The Breakfast Club and that's what it was about. There you go. So that was my edition. Uh, 4,785. And then inside here as well, you've got um, a set of films on Toby Hooper's early works. So you get two discs in there. Um, that's the artwork on the outside. And then you've got one, which is region zero. So that's uh, region three. And then you've got one, which is ABC region. There you go. So quite why one is ABC region and region three, I don't know. Um, but if I flip that over, uh, you'll actually see there the details about his early works just in case. Um, I actually liked Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2. I, I don't really have much qualms with it. I think it's a really good film. The ending of it is insane, and it's just the amount of screaming at the end of it is crazy. But anyway, guys, any questions, let me know. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. Um, I've got a few things going on at the moment, unfortunately, so I'm not going to be posting as many films as I had hoped a few weeks back. Um, but I am still watching vlogs, and I will get back to um, everybody's replies as soon as I can. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe, take care, and see you on my next vlog, which should be some Zavi cell pickups that I got recently. Anyway, take care, guys.